It's the East Anglia Derby. Let's go to Carrow Road and pick up those points. Riding along on my tractor, honey, when I notice you. Hello everyone, Cam Bear Run here. Welcome back to FN24 with Ip Ipswich Town. Today we're going to be doing the East Anglia Derby, which means we haven't actually played any games since you last joined us. And we're also going to be playing Reading in the midweek. So, <clears throat> I am waiting on da David William Howard Jr. to get his work permit, because that has to be a thing, he is Chilean. The other part I never mentioned about uh, the transfer history, we actually raised a lot of money selling Will Hughes to Hellas Rota for about 10 million, <laughs> 10 million pound, because he hit a little mighty fuss about wanting to go. So it's kind of what funded a lot of my spending. In fact, I've actually made a profit now that I've seen it. 11.5 million out, 6.25 million in. And we still haven't got to deadline day yet. Although with the money that I've had to switch around, um, probably signing Hara Jr. is going to take up the rest of my money. So we're going to go straight into the tactical meeting. We are the last game of the day. So we are going to mark Josh Sargent. As long as we know the weak foot. And then that should be fine. Oh, Helvetti. Uh, right. Just make sure that... Alright. So. Do we have any? Yeah. Might be able to get thing. Might be able to switch out Finn Clark then if he's not fully fit. Yeah, he's not fully fit. Shit. So it's Finn back it is. So we've got Svilar in goal. We've got a back four of... I don't fucking remember. I forgot what my left back is. I know we've got Wolf in the Twitch. Yeah, Svilar, Finn back, Axel Twanzebi, Luke Wolfenden, Leif Davis, Amiri in the attacking midfield role. Holgate, Irogabunam, Dobbin, Johnson and Adebayo. I'm hoping we've got the work permit hearing for Junior on the 18th, or Junior on the 18th, so I'm hoping that we'll uh, get him in for the Reading game. We're just going to ignore the fucking TV kickoff. Yeah, we're uh, we're on TV. We're at Carroll Road. It's the big, big East Anglia derby. It's been fiercer ever since they both got stuck in the uh, EFL. So, <laughs> there is that. Uh, right. We need to be up for this. Good save. I'm trying to drink my coke, but I need to balance my microphone. out. Johnson's away here. He's played it through to Holgate. Holgate! Oh, he could have put that into Adebayo, I think, but we got the shot away and made his fourth save. Get ahead on it. Or not. Ooh. Ah. Damn it. I was hoping we might be able to get a shot away there. Might as well, free kick, apparently. It's a good ball through, goes into Dobbin. Oh, that's come out to Johnson. Oh, what the fuck? That was their goal. That was their goal. That's the goalkeeper that turned us down coming from Bolton. Decided he didn't want to play for Ipswich, he decided to go to Norwich instead. Dobbin managed to get the ball out to Johnson there. The ball goes in, bounces off. Oh, ooh. The defender tries to kick it away and it comes off the goalie's ass. Oh dear. Lol. Imagine having that happen against the arch your club's arch rivals. 
You should have come to Ipswich, bro. We were we we guarantee our defenders won't kick the ball straight out of your ass. We promise. We, <laughs> Jesus. That was that was pretty funny. Oh, oh, great, great from Dobbin there, and then it just fucking goes over. <sighs> Problem is, Max D is still not really fit, so Amiri's got to play in the. We need to bully them. This is the important... Oh, that's a good intercept. And that's what I mean by bully them. Get up in them. Get in their faces. And that was... Well, no, it was a blocked corner, to be fair. Right. So let's get it... When, uh, yeah, opening the second half with a goal would be great. But that's not going to open with a... That's not going to be a goal. Uh, oh, that was piss poor. Nope. Good block by Twanzebi. That was a very good block. I don't think he knew much about it as well. Oh, that's a nice ball. But then it's just too far. We're well on top, I'll give him that. <laughs> it just <laughs> takes a walk around the box, almost gets the shot off. All right, let's. Jesus, Mary's crossing him in wank. That's really good from Twan's AB to mark his man there, get the ball off him. That's uh, that's United Academy graduate quality there. Ah, uh, all right. Well, the highlights come to an end anyway. All right, I'm going to take a Mary off. We're going to put Matthias Roberts on. Unfortunately, McT still isn't fit. So, where is Matthias Roberts? Go on, kid. Right, Dobbin can run with this. He gets past his man. And he scores! Fuck, that was brilliant. Takes the ball, runs, gets past his man, and just hammers that home. Can Ballard actually play left wing? Uh, let's, let's have a look at Ballard. Can he... No, he can't. Oh, no, he can... Play on the left as a rap, as a rap, rom du tu. Johnson's just going to have to cope. Right, well, we're kicking off again. Oh, just about got the block in. That was a little bit cheeky from Dobbin there. He knows he's about to make a good pass, so he just kicks him in the back of the knee, back of the ankles. Oh fuck me, that's annoying. Right, damn it. It's annoying you have to do that. Right, so. I'm going to put on George Hurst. Go forward on the attack. And then... Who else have we got? If I push further up here to the midfield and then bring on Bubakar Traore. 
and you can do your whole central midfield on attack and push forward and join in. Hopefully that won't cost us too much. Ooh, I need to... They've, they've stuck to you cheeky cunts. They've stuck to up top. No wonder it's become so much of an issue. Actually, let's look at that again. So you really want to be marking Sergeant. And then you're going to have to mark Greenwood. Yeah. Okay. No wonder we've had a few problems. They've uh, put two up top now and the fucking running at us with both. Have both of them marked. Good header out. Ooh, that won't count, I don't think. Yeah. He was stood miles ahead of the defenders. I need to make, yeah, I need to make some fitness subs because people are starting to get tired now. So we'll do that. Clock can come on for the last, like, two minutes or so. That's such a giveaway. What oh, that, that last ditch tackling and blocking. Holy crap, it's been all Norwich since they scored. Oh, they got they handled the ball. And it's all, holy shit. We just about got away with that win. That was crazy. From the moment when Norwich scored, they were just completely in control. Shame the Finback goal got disallowed. So, uh, we managed to get there. I think there were some very tired legs at the end as well. We managed to go there and we won at Carroll Road. That should endear me to the fans. Mm. Nice. Wagner can cry about it. In fact, we're going to make sure he knows how to cry about it. Well, no, yeah. I'm not going to throw him a flame on, actually. All right, I'm going to move ahead to the game against Reading. Give me a second. All right, time to face Reading. So, one second, just one quick change. Take fitness reasons. So, we've got Svilar, Norwich and Davis, Wolfenden, Twanzebe, Clark, Amiri, Traore, Hara Jr., who has now got his work permit and is starting his first game. McAtee, who can at least play for 75 minutes, will probably take him off half-timer on the hour mark. Dobbin and Ballard. So, let's fucking go. Ah, you'll be fine. I think Reading are in four. They've actually had a good start. We need to match that. Hang on. Uh, one second. Sorry, I'm trying to get the coat ball open. I'll stop with the microphone in my hand. There we go. So, let's see. All right. Let's go.
I see what this new guy can do. It's a good ball over to Dobbin. That's oh, what? <laughs> That's very kind. That's a great debut. Two minutes in. Not only does he play the that pretty good pass, but he very cleverly moves around the back of the defense. Adebayo can't get there, but he's readily placed to put in to slot the ball though. Very impressive on the debut. Very nice. <sighs> Could have challenged for that header though. All right. Back to Mary. Back to Twan Zabi. And, oh, wow. And he's got two already. A, si a six-minute brace on his debut. What a start. <clears throat> I think... Uh, I think it's going to be three million well spent. Mikey Johnson's going to have a hell of a time getting his place back. All right. That's your point. I should have put Mikey Johnson on the bench, but of course I wanted to give him the rest. Uh, right. Oh, Dobbin, come on, man. He's He's got the goalkeeper dead to rights and he hits the post. Why don't you do this? <coughs> come on. No, you got to throw it here. Good pick up by Wolfenden. Don't fuck around with it on the edge of the box, guys. You can pick that up. Oh, that's poor. Mary's got it, though. <sighs> Fuck. That, right, Norrington, why? No, oh, well, I didn't come to much, but... Norrington Davies runs straight at his man and then just get done. Brilliant. <sighs> that was close. Reading are having their chances. Got a corner here. Almost the hat trick. I'll tell you what, this guy, uh, this guy's looking to impress on his first game. Really? Ballard, why? All right, that's pretty good at half time. Hey. Don't like them kicking out of Max either. He's already injured his ears. I don't want any more damage done to him. Right, take off Max D in a minute. Need him fresh for Stoke. I mean, it's it's going with 5 3. We've got 61% possession as well. We're, kind of, we're all over them. Uh, amazing power of uh, playing well. See, Maxine just gets blocked off there and they don't give the foul. And then we can run him off the ball. Brilliant. Alright, picked up by Dobbin. Goes all the way back. To Norrington Davis. Mary. That was poor. Come on, lads. Good tackle. And then... That was a... Yeah, that was straight through the back of the, the man. That's a red all day. Right. So, I'm going to take off Mac T. We'll put on Matthias Roberts. And Mary can come off. And... Uh, no, actually. Let's we'll take off Troy and bring on Mason Holgate. And then we can bring on Hurst. There's three changes. And then, yeah, we'll put on Mete as well. A 
Hey yo, that's uh, another writing play, but they they are um, they're really losing their heads out there. Oh, Morgate, Holgate just takes a shot, have a banger. All right, we'll make one last change. Don uh, Zabi can come off and Pollock can come on. Look at that slick passing. And Mete gets... Oh, that's a shame. Didn't look offside. Ah, narrowly. Yeah, he's... I didn't see it at first, but he was stood in right in front of the defender. Look at, look at, look at all that. They've had man sent off. They're, 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 they're beginning fine for that. They will be getting fined for that. Sure of it. Ooh. Sevilla had to be quick there. Looks like those two early goals from Hara Jr. were, uh, will be enough. So. Yeah. I'm happy. Oh, that, that should have been a goal from Hurst there. He's really missed, the, missed his chance. Ooh, Mate didn't though. That's uh Mate getting his second goal of the season. Mm. That's great, that's Norrington Davis running free and runs into too much trouble. We do have the corner. Oh no, we don't even get to take it, the game's over. Well, that's pretty good. 3-0 three, three win. It was helped by the fact that Reading had a... Well, they got a sending off and they... Jesus, they had a bad game. They were not very good. Um, but, uh, yeah, we completely dominated them and ran out 3-0 winners. So, uh, that's all in a day's work. We are now three... We are a clear three points ahead of the rest of the pack. And we've got some good games coming up. Superb. Right. A very rarely compliment players, but to be honest, scoring a, what, six-minute brace on your debut? That's something good. Four minutes between both goals as well. So, right. So, we've started this campaign very, very well. So, we will come back. I'll get through all of this. And we will come back for, uh, let's say, Fleetwood and Bristol City. Because, basically, over this Christmas period, I'm going to be ducking in and out. For the next week. Obviously I took yesterday off. Because I went Christmas shopping yesterday. And it was exhausting. So I will be putting up a video on Christmas Eve. Uh, for all you guys. And so I will be then from. Get a bit sketchy. Because I'm probably not going to put up a video Christmas Day. Tuesday the Boxing Day. I'm going to the County Ground to watch Swinner vs Wrexham. And then we'll just probably try and get up videos Wednesday, Thursday. And then I'm going to visit relatives all the way up to the other side of the country for New Year. So well, the next week's upload schedule might be a little bit sketchy. Anyway, if you've enjoyed this, feel free to leave a like. If you want to see more, you can always subscribe. And I'll be back on Sunday. I've been Cam Run, and thank you for watching.